There's a scrub brush, which I do not need. Inside the helicopter. Nice. I'll be using this. What we have here is a potential escape route. In the meantime, I'm going to heal myself because I needed that real bad. Anyway, I'll step right back out. Never been in a helicopter before. I'm feeling a little better at least. Also, this area is a blast from the past. This is from Outbreak File 1, which is pretty cool. Also, here's Kevin, just completely hidden until now. Thanks for the help with the tyrant, weirdo. Oh, here we go, stairway. But what's the sparkly I just saw? An entire handgun. Yeah, she could definitely take that. I really probably shouldn't be hoarding all the ammo. Footbridge. Green herb is very nice. Maybe I'll even take it. If I find something to replace it, then I will. I see the brush, but not any sparkly. I'm looking for more sparklies. Shotgun rounds, yes. Shotgun rounds, yes. Yeah, that's much more like it. Moving on. Keep on moving, keep on moving. Nothing, just a blue herb. Come on! What the hell, Sniper Wolf? This will be the 99th rodent I kill. Wait a sec. I think that may be a live one. Eh, yeah, well, fuck it. <laughs> what are you doing? Get the hell out there and find them. How long do you plan to just sit here and do nothing? Can you get it through your thick skull? If the package gets out, it will be your neck on the line, not mine. Sir, landmine placement complete. Okay. That seals off any ground exit. What? Did you forget I'm the one that gives the orders here? Wait! Think of the position I'm in. <gasps> damn, damn. Oh, okay. One hundred. I love that he really thought Linda was a zombie. He's not, like, just a total asshole, but but then he is. Oh, that was a live one. Eh, fuck it. He literally said fuck it. Oh, good job, idiot. Yeah, we're gonna have to deal with this now. There's a particular sparkly I want, and you can see why. Stun rod, no. Mine detector. Let's equip it. Maybe we're just good. Office building warehouse. I agree, we should move. Ah, crap, this thing's getting back up. Also, I didn't reload, I equipped. Mark. Hey, you. Ugh. At least I have a healthy amount of shotgun ammo now. I feel better about that. Zombies are gone, let's get out of here. Magnum revolver S loader, kick ass, but I don't have a magnum revolver. First aid spray, kick ass, but I don't have room. I need a stupid mine detector. Anyway. Office building, first floor. Let's just go. Code double 
Lex. They plan to contain the incident the old-fashioned way, blowing up the target location and everyone in it with missiles? Why didn't you say anything, you weasel? I, I, I kept telling you to hurry! Damn. Oh. Well, but where are you going? You need to find that capsule! You do it. I'm not gonna go up in flames with the rest of the town. This job is turning out to be a lot hotter than I had expected. Hey! Wait! He's got a point. I'm not just going to stick around with a nuke Raccoon City again. The order to forego double X into effect has been issued. All units within the target area evacuate immediately. Repeat. The order to put code double X into effect has been issued. All units within the target area evacuate immediately. So it has begun. <laughs> it has begun. I don't have much of a choice. Time to get my butt out of here. And there's the countdown. This is not a countdown to self-destruct. This is countdown to escape in helicopter. If I want to, I can go back to the beginning. Uh, well, back a few screens anyway, and go back to that helicopter, and just leave. I can just do that, but I'm not going to. Under the highway overpass. Let's not hug mines. Also, excuse me. Oh good, Kevin walked on a mine. Come on. Ugh. And now he's in danger condition because he walked on a damn mine. This is why you stick with me. Got it? Wow. My party members are gonna die because they're just running and doing their own thing. Push comes to shove, I'll have an easy time of it. Construction site. Good. Let's move. You're shuffling. Is that like not a spark light? Wow. Shotgun rounds, hey. Do they seriously set off all the mines? I am partly irritated and partly relieved, because I have absolutely paid for this before. Also, did you notice they have three shotguns among them? One of them is holding two shotguns. Anyway, in front of Apple Inn. Oh. We're not done. Mine. Let's Safe move. now. This is a shitty situation. Yeah, you're telling me. Oh, is this? That's a first aid spray. Come on! No way! Mark. No way. Uh, just first aid spray, buddy. Let's save the game. Actually, I'll wait for the countdown to finish. Whatever, I'll save. It's fine. Alright. And if you guys want a freaking first aid spray, because... Now's your damn chance. 
Anyway, we're, we're going outside with Linda. Warning be damned. I think the mines that I would have had to deal with are just gone now. Because my dumbass party ran into them. Okay, hold on. Oh, whoop. Um, yep, it's gone. That was my ticket out of here. I could have gotten the bad ending and just left and not done any of this. Wow. And he missed. That's a problem. That sucks. Is that the package? That's not good. What, the? what? Whoa. That's a nightmare. The whole team is gone in an instant. Wow. That is a no thank you from me. You know what I'm going to do? I'm actually going to immediately save again because, there we go, because that was a whole scene. And should the worst happen, I really don't feel like reloading this area and then having to fade out and wait for the scene to end, so we're just going to save right now. And I'm going to heal Cindy if I can help it. Now let's get out of here. Is Linda just out there? I hope Linda's out here. Okay, she's chilling. Uh, Cindy, what are you doing? C Cindy, 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 yeah. Cindy, what the hell are you doing? Now use it. Good. All right, so I'm gonna grab Linda. I don't think I need the mind detector anymore, embarrassingly, because my party just Stepped on all the freaking mines. I don't know where Kevin is. I hope he's a lot- wait. No, that's Cindy way up ahead. It's a shame that I can't hold the circle button to run because pressing circle will release Linda. Also, this whole thing is optional. I could also go for the second escape route without her. I would certainly be faster if I tried that. Oh, there's Kevin. He could also use healing. Great. Anyway, back in the construction site. Let's hope for the best. My dumbass team, I think, detonated every single mine, and if they didn't, they're about to. I'll just follow them. Oh. Kevin's pulling his weight. I'll, I'll take that. If you guys want to open the door, no, it's fine. <sighs> Here we go again. Kevin, you need a green herb. Mark. Well, I meant to grab the. Okay. You know what I'm gonna do? Hey you, Mark. Hey you. 
Got it. Now, I'm going to grab this, combine them. And now, Kevin, I damn well better not walk in any mines, I swear to God. Get over here. Send decent caution, I don't like that. What I do like is Kevin decided to be smart. Nobody better step on any damn mines, I'm telling you. And it looks like if you get far enough away... No, okay, I guess Linda's still shambling along, but I'm afraid that if you get far enough away from her, she just gives up. I am only going to attempt this incredibly slow escort mission once. Should I die on the final boss, I'm just gonna run the hell out of here. Best ending be damned, because this is agony. If they all just jogged over there super casually, then... I guess this means that there's no mine. Linda, come along. The zombie's already dead. Back in the office building. Alright, what's that? Well, it's good that I picked up Cindy, but I'm looking at the item. Or trying to. Shotgun! Alright. First of all, let me do a quick jog. I have a lot of shotgun ammo. He's done. Yeah, Linda just stays if you get far away enough. Brutal. Again, I'm only trying this once because this is so slow. And Cindy's not looking so good. We better get some health items and quickly. I should probably also distribute my weapons to some degree. Cindy can heal. Oh, she took it. Good. Good, 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 good. I was gonna say, don't make me take it for you. She just took something else. I don't know what that was. Are you okay? You're walking funny. Yeah, well. Anyway, up we go. Office building stairwell. Sorry, no. Oh, there's grenade ammo. Damn, did one of them pick up a submachine gun? Good for them. Where the hell did they get that from? Anyway, whatever was ahead of me has got to be gone now. I think there were actually two zombies too, but <laughs> never mind that. Get out of here. It's the elevated railway. Oh, I saw a file. Yelinda knows where to go. Paperwork, sure. Got it. And now we prepare our epic finale. Time to jump. Or I could completely flood the jump. Yeah. It's fine, it just takes me an hour to climb. It is possible to properly jump across and only have to slightly vault myself up, but it's fine. Rooftop elevated railway, other side. Oh, come on. Oh, oh. That's brilliant. That doesn't happen. Welcome to the final boss. I think I see a first aid spray way behind it, but before I deal with that, give me just a moment, please. Pretty cool, put sugar on top. I'm taking not that. Hey you. Hey you. Thank you. Another 
a shotgun. Magically, I just didn't get hit. Did somebody take something else that I wanted? Wait, I... Hey, you. Did she have it? Magnum Revolver, I'll take that, but... It's just not hitting me. This is a riot. Yeah, that's better. I don't want the damn shotgun. Thank you. The rocket launcher. Why did that take an hour? Anyway, let's fight the final boss. As I abuse my iframes. Where's the giant final boss? Why can't I see the giant? Whoop. Gross. What are you? Anyway, this thing is like an RPG boss where I have to hit him until he opens his core and becomes vulnerable. I'm gonna go this way. Well, that didn't hit me. I can't, like, see this thing. If I get close enough to it where I can see it, then yeah, I'm this close. I'm gonna go the other way now. I need to handle this very carefully. I only have six... Okay. Six magnum ammo shots. And not that much health. What is this, a shotgun? Grenade launcher burst rounds. Damn. Maybe I'll use that. Or maybe Cindy will use that. What? Wait, it, it, it can crawl close. Get right up in its grill and not die. Alright, that was fun. Goodbye. I've, I've had my fun. Good. Mark! What are you. Oh, that's not good. I think she's dead. Did she get taken into the amalgam or what? Goodbye, that was fun. See ya. Reload faster, please. While Kevin does some damage too. I hope this doesn't mean I lost the grenade launcher because Cindy died. Oh, the core's open. Oh, did I win? Wow. Oh my god, Cindy's alive for no reason. Alright, so now I have the option between going for the good ending and the best ending. If I could find what I'm looking for. Because what I want is the Jeep. But... Yeah, that doesn't matter. Is this what I need? Use this board to make a bridge to the rooftop. Yep, did it. I'll just take you. Too bad the entire level isn't stairs, even though you normally move up them more slowly. You glide with Linda. But here we go, I get in the Jeep and we're done. I am very pleased about this, by the way, because this is not my first attempt playing this level. On my first attempt, I made it to the boss with around 94-95% virus. So the boss never really killed me. I just died during the fight my virus went up. It was so bad. So I actually had to restart the entire scenario because I saved the Apple Inn when I had like 90% virus. It was miserable. But this time, I was successful. Didn't even need the rocket launcher. Let's get out of here.
Expect hit on the target, sir. Angel One, both missiles are confirmed hits. Return to base immediately. This is Angel One, roger that. Arrow Seven and Ten, direct hit. Both Angel Two and Three have emptied their payload. Arrow Five, correction. In hit coordinates, west 0.5, south 0.1. Roger. This is Angel Six reporting. Confirmed all fighters have emptied their payload. Mission code double X complete. Repeat, mission code double X complete. This is Heaven's Gate. We got you loud and clear, Angel Six. Mission code double X is completed. All fighters return to base immediately. Roger that. Arrow 8, 11, target hit confirmation. Arrow 3, 2, 1. <laughs> fill a book with all the regrets and bad memories of those days. But being there, surrounded by all of that death and decay, taught me one important lesson that I didn't even learn in honor. That in the power to protect people, the ones you love, lay true valor and righteousness. It's my duty to survive and tell this day. Yeah, there he is. And there she is. What's done is done. We can't take it back. However, we may be able to start again from the beginning. That's the one gift we humans have. We can rebuild. Hooray! Hooray! I actually did it. This was a brutal level, but I made it happen. Yes. Oh, what's this? Nothing new with me. Just as dull as ever. Of course, that hardly means I'm looking for a little adventure or anything. That's great. He made it. Full on happy ending. That's excellent. Good for you, Mark. Damn, he's earned it. That feels really good. And that was just easy. So what did I do? I used the ammo disc stuff, I opened the shutters with a passcode, used the dummy grenade. What does that mean? Like the, the remote that insta-kills the tyrant? I saw Finding Linda. Put a hole in the floor. I guess FLDGT is floodgate room. Uh, valve handle. Saw scenes. Blew up tyrant. There you go. Located mines. I guess. Defeated. Yeah, that's the final boss. Nyx, which is the Greek goddess of night. I think. Run like the Linda. That's pretty funny. Linda survived. Spoke with Carter. Oh, I wonder if I would have gotten something for speaking with Linda, because she also has just text in that first room you see here. ID cards, got some files. All right. Of course. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Hard mode. Can't wait. Partner customized mode? I forgot what that means. Like, you could choose which partners have which items? I don't quite remember. Showdown 2? Uh, I'm absolutely saving, because that was a lot. Okay. Just back to the opening scene makes sense. We're not going to the scenario menu anymore because I finished them all, so it's full reset. But let me see something. Data convert, I don't need that, but collection.
you know, sorts of cool stuff. Oh, here's extra. Hard difficulty is now available. I have to buy it though. Costumes and NPC characters are now selectable. That's pretty rad. Elimination 1, Elimination 2, Showdown 1 and 2. Yikes. I think they're kind of like the battle modes in previous Resident Evils where you run through rooms and take out enemies, including some bosses. One of these things, I think, has a giant leech, which is just kind of novel. It was an Outbreak 1. There's Mutated G. Uh, there's different types of tyrants. Zombie Elephant, Zombie Lion, Nyx again. So that's pretty cool, but the important thing is... Outbreak. File two. I have completed all of the scenarios. I could always buy my way into Elimination and Showdown for even more challenges, but this is the main game. I've done it. And this was quite fun. Well, we have done it. We have beaten Resident Evil Outbreak File Number 2. I'm quite proud of myself for this. I, I said I wouldn't play either Outbreak game on my channel, they're just too hard. But I did. Now I know this was easy mode, but even so I was playing by myself when this game is supposed to support four people. Yes, it gets harder, even on easy, if you play with more people or if you play online, but still, I had to juggle all this stuff by myself. And I gotta say, as hard as I said both games were, I never actually died and had to restart a level in Outbreak 1. I came so close in the Poison Hospital level of 2, and I actually did have to restart the whole level for the final level. Now yes, I can reload old save files, and in fact I did. It's just that where I had saved, I had something like 90% viral infection, so by the time I made it to the boss, he only had to hit me once or twice, and that was it. It's not even that I was on such low health, it's that that increased my viral infection to the point where it killed me. I, I really could not reasonably do that, so I had to restart the whole level, less than fun. But you know what? I did it. I got the good ending. I could have abandoned the last third of the level or so and gotten in the helicopter, but I didn't. I could have abandoned the umbrella worker and just run to the boss, but I didn't took care of it. We got the good ending. We got to see Mark just chilling with his family. That was satisfying. Don't worry, everybody. Outbreak is over. Uh, the, the game, that is. Not necessarily the viral contagion. There's always a viral contagion in Resident Evil. Boy, is there ever. But you know what? We've done it. Thank you very much for watching this playthrough. I hope you enjoyed watching it as much as I enjoyed experiencing it, because... I didn't know what these levels were going to be. This is new to me. People talk about the mainstream games, and I have a general idea of what's going on in the numbered titles, but I knew nothing of Outbreak. So this was a whole new experience for me. Very fun. And, well, the next game I'm going to play, we're going back to classic point-and-click. One that's pretty user-friendly and has a fair amount of sass. I hope you look forward to it. Until next time, everyone.